Hi Colleen, het is zondag en ik ben klaar met mijn cursus Nederlands. De klas was great. I had really nice teachers and really lovely classmates um, who will probably see this because Facebook. So, hi guys! I thought that I would start my video by sharing my favorite word and my favorite phrase that I learned in the class. Uh, my favorite word is not a, a useful word, shall we say. Uh, I just think it's fun to say. Gemobilaird. And my favorite phrase means like small talk, but the literal translation is really cute. Traten over kutjes en kafjes. Dad said that I should make a video giving a tour of my neighborhood. Uh, but today is Sunday, which means everything is closed and it's kind of a ghost town. Um, so I'm going to take some footage during the week next week so you can see the market and the university when there's actually people in them. Uh, but that means I don't have anything to talk about this week. Uh. Let's talk about culture shock. And during Kai Week, I was put in a group of entirely Dutch students. Um, it wasn't a big deal because I speak enough Dutch to follow along with like basic conversations, um, and everyone was happy to translate for me, but it was just a lot of effort to keep up. So one afternoon, there was a comedy show, uh, and my whole group went, and I sat down, and I realized, oh my god, this is going to be in Dutch. So the comedian started in Dutch, and everyone was laughing, and I started just feeling weirdly panicked. Something was going on all around me, and I understood a word here and a word there, but not enough to get the joke. So I just had no idea what was going on. Um, and that is kind of what being in a foreign country feels like, uh, even when people are speaking English. I couldn't really tell you like what it is about the Netherlands that's different from America. like. College is college, so my university is, is a lot like my university at home, but at the same time it's different. Uh, grocery shopping is going to be the same anywhere you go, but I don't recognize a lot of the food on the shelves. Um, even just flipping channels is a little bit different, because the way they schedule TV is different here. So there's a lot of things that I really, really like about Dutch culture. I like how the market sells fresh flowers, and so you'll see people cycling down the street with like uh, bouquets in their bike basket uh, and people like put put vases in their windows and it's very pretty. I love seeing little kids on their bikes. The smallest kids have these little like scooters with seats. They're not even really bikes uh, but the kids always just look so proud of themselves like waddling down the street on their very own like tiny bicycle. It's really cute and whenever I go to the market and can buy my vegetables in Dutch I'm always like so proud of myself, but there's just a lot that I need to get used to, so I'm still kind of settling in here. And I think I'll know that I feel at home when I can laugh at jokes in Dutch. Next week, I start my classes in religion and the public domain, which will be really cool. I've been thinking a lot about what kind of research I want to do, but I'm still not 100% sure, so I'm going to go to the library on Monday um, and start making some plans. I got my student card which is cool because not only does that mean I can go to the library, but it also means I can get tea from the hot drink machine on campus. And so it's definitely the end of summer vacation if I'm getting excited about sitting in the library drinking tea. I hope that you're having a great last couple weeks of vacation. Eat an extra brownie for me at the neighborhood Labor Day picnic. Good luck with the rest of your summer homework and I will see you next week. Bye.